I need you guys to stop what you're doing and check this out. I got my hands on one of the Intel Arc GPUs and we're going to be doing a very quick unboxing just to see how it is. It's my first time getting my hands on on one of these GPUs from Intel. This is obviously their first time trying out an actual discrete GPU and putting themselves into the market against Nvidia and AMD. And I am super excited to finally get my hands on one. And you guys are going to see this here with me and unbox it with me right now. So let me stop talking. I'm too excited as you can clearly see, but I don't care. Let's get to it. All right, guys, and here it is the Intel Arc A750. Now, before I unbox it, I just wanna give a very quick shout out to my boy, Jake, who actually bought this graphics card for. I'm gonna ship it out to him, but he gave me the gracious opportunity and permission, of course, to unbox this for you guys here on the channel. So Jake, thank you so much, my brother. I really do appreciate it. And with that being said, let's unbox this bad boy. So you see there's a little stick over here. You can kind of just force it open. And here is the card in all of its glory. Now, I should say that I did buy this card for retail. It was $289, you guys. Can we just take a moment and enjoy the fact that we were able to get a GPU for retail? Yes, it's been two years. Let's normalize this again. Here is the card though. It is in all black. I love this top plate right here. I love the branding on it. Limited edition, not exactly sure why it is. I will write it down below to find out why it's a limited edition. I think it's probably because this is the founder's edition, you know, founder's edition as compared to what Nvidia does, but this is Intel's founders and I think that's why it's limited, but you do see that it is all black everywhere. There's, there are some silver accents around here, which gives it a very nice touch, but it is all black. Even the plate here on top is all black and I absolutely love that. If you are building an all black PC, a no RGB PC, or just a stealth looking PC build, I think this might be the card for you guys if you're okay with the performance that it gives off. It's very RTX 3060 vibes. Um, you do see that it does come with an eight pin and a six pin connector. You do see here in the back that it has one HDMI and I believe, yes, these are three display ports. So you do have your four um, video connections back here. And that's pretty much it, you guys. This is the Enzo Arc uh, Founders Edition, if you will. And I think it does look great. Now, I do wish that it did come with some RGB. Um, the Intel A770, there's a limited edition of that one that does have RGB, but if you don't care for it, and obviously if you wanna save some cost, then obviously this is the choice for you. So let's close this video out, and yeah, I'm excited, guys. Intel's in the game, man, let's do it, let's do it. All right, guys, and that was just my quick unboxing of this GPU right here, the Intel Arc. A750. Now, Jake, thank you so much, my brother, for allowing me to go ahead and do the unboxing here on the channel. I promise I am taking care of this card and I will send it to you right away. I do wish I was able to do a build with this card, but unfortunately, I don't have the components right now and I'd rather just send it off to him so he can go ahead and use it to his will. But I hope you guys were able to enjoy this. I am very glad that Enzo is in the game and competing with Nvidia and AMD. And here's hoping that they do shake up the market just a little bit to lower prices and make things more affordable for us. So if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to hit like and also do not forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys all so much for watching and we will see you all in the next one.